Hello YouTube, I'm back. Uh, in response to my own video, I did a little bit of research and looked into stuff and uh, this is where I'm at. I would encourage any and all people <clears throat> to research on their own to not just my videos but everyone else's videos to look into stuff. But I did a video about That's Illegal where I was refused to be able to pay cash due to I believe uh, the way it's referred to by Viva La Frey is my Sharona. Um, and it deals with, are we allowed, can they refuse paying cash with legal tender? Now, I tried to Google and Google and Google and do research, and I don't have any of my law books as handy as I used to, and... The law books I have will be out of date. But what I mostly found was stuff from the states, which anyone who looks into legal stuff in Canada will agree with me. Um, trying to get an honest, perfect, proper response out of Canada is like looking for a tiny flea in a pile of dirt. It's just a tiny fleck that you're not going to find. Because, well, we don't really want anything to be... We're wishy-washy. We don't ever put anything down properly because we don't have the legs to stand on here in Canada. That's why we don't have a proper constitution. Like you guys in the States. I can't even speak my mind about sexual preferences here now because that's some sort of a hate crime but anyways on a different note turns out i was wrong by which i'm saying i was wrong which means all you other people are wrong if a convenience store wants to say nope that's legal tender but i don't accept it um well you're screwed. You can show up with a $20 bill at your local convenience store and they can say, nope. We want a plastic version of that money because it's a fiat currency which is not backed by anything, which is just basically, well, some people believe that it's worth this much, so you should too. Anyways, guys, um... Again, with the My Sharona virus, never let a crisis go to waste. They're going to push a lot of this stuff towards a cashless society. And I feel sad about it. And uh, it makes it so it's going to be more difficult for my own life and a few other people that I know. And, uh... Oh, look, they've already set it up where there's nothing I can do about it. Thank you, my prime ministers of previous and my prime minister current. And also to my American friends, several of your presidents throughout history. They have set this up to say, screw you, you don't count. I would love to say let's fight this, but... Uh, and I think we're past that point. I honestly do think we're past the point of being able to fight some of that stuff. It's unfortunate. What else can I say? Have a good night, guys. Uh, from a very depressed, screwed over Canadian, you have a good night. Bye.